Process reliability is a make or break issue when manufacturing series production parts. A 100% check of these parts is often impossible, or at least not economically viable. The use of defective parts can lead to enormous follow-up costs, including, for example, vehicle recalls in the automotive industry. The goal is to manufacture workpieces with reliable, reproducible quality. For decades, Schlick has been one of the leading manufacturers of surface treatment technology and is well known for customer-specific solutions to special challenges. In order to ensure the reliability of the production process, Schlick developed a process reliability package that gives the user decisive advantages. Minimization of machine's downtime. Control of abrasive's throwing speed. Control of blast pattern. Control of throwing blades wear. Adjustment of the abrasive amount in kilograms per minute. Mounted on a transport car, a complete turbine unit can be easily uncoupled from the blasting cabin during maintenance. Even in the event of more extensive maintenance on the turbine, the downtime of the unit remains low because it is possible to immediately connect the backup turbine. The unit returns to full operation in virtually no time at all. A change in the abrasive ejection speed, for example during dual peening, simultaneously causes a displacement in the blasting pattern. In order to return the pattern to its optimal position, an automatic adjustment system corrects the position of the guide channel. The position of the guide channel, shown here in yellow, is stored in memory as a function of the turbine speed. In this way, the position of the blasting pattern remains constant, even at different abrasive ejection speeds. The position of the blasting pattern is not only dependent on the speed of the turbine, but also on the degree of wear to the guide channel. By using a patented multi-level system, the current level of wear is automatically monitored and then automatically compensated by adjusting the position of the guide channel. Inadequate or unprofessional maintenance in this area has already led to minor catastrophes. The current state of wear is displayed on the operator panel and also by a warning light that signals the final stage in the wear process. The resources required to maintain, control and adjust the blasting pattern are reduced to virtually zero. Badly worn turbine blades hinder the even flow of abrasive, which of course also prevents a perfect blasting result. The experienced maintenance technician recognizes this state of affairs by using his hand to sense the increase in turbine vibration caused by the unbalanced mass of the turbine blades. An electronic vibration sensor can replace this procedure. The sensor sends a corresponding signal to the control unit when the vibration reaches a preset maximum level. While this technology is not intended to completely replace visual inspections, it can substantially increase the intervals between such inspections. When the blasting unit is not in operation, a permanent magnetic field closes off the flow of abrasive. During operation, an opposing pulsating electromagnetic field is created. This weakens the permanent magnetic field and opens the flow of abrasive. The flowing abrasive causes measurable changes in the magnetic field that serve as regulating variables and that are shown on the display. The amount of abrasive is preset by the control system in kilograms per minute and is kept constant 